All right, hello everyone. Um, welcome back. I miss you guys a lot. Um, Elizabeth, Johnny, and Sharon. Um, I'm in South Carolina right now, and I still have this drawing. Um, from Elizabeth with back in uh, Colorado. I don't know if you remember. Huh? I really love love, um, love you guys and thank you for all these encouragement. And um, I want to play a song for you guys that I really liked about the how how the Jesus Christ endured the cross for us. He was, and these are the lyrics. Um, and have you heard of it? The sons cry, he is on the cross with the father, with blood and tears. Nagashirana, blood and tears falling on his face. Kodoku ni tatakau, lonely, alone he's fighting. And then let's look at, behold Jesus, right? Hebrews 12. One through two. I want you guys to read those. And he gave us the eternal life through his lonely battle and save us from the swamp. No matter what happened, he'll still love us. He's that son. Even he had to self-sacrifice, do the hard thing, he would still give us what we need. Oh, I have to share this sound too, sorry. Always forget that. Kikoe means uh, here, and Kikoe de Kuru is I uh, hear. Right. The sun's cry. Kono chika. Um, Kono sake pi. Jujika. Kara Jujika is a cross. Everyone say Jujika. Jujika is close. Jujika Kara. Kara means from. Okay. So today our lesson learning this from the song is Kara is from. Chichi no Tomoni. Kara means from. Everyone say Kara is from. Kara. Jujika Kara. Everyone say Jujika Kara. Okay. It means from the cross. Chichi no, this means chichi. Chichi means chichi means father, right? Even tomo mo motoni by the side. Motoni means by the side. Okay, father. I want you guys to write this in notebook. Chichi father. And uh, motoni means on the side. And later on, we'll make sentence. But um, I want you guys to keep listening and enjoy this one.
And uh, before we continue, let's go through the lyrics, you guys. So, um, Chito Namida, Motori means by the side, okay? Make sure you put this in the notebook by the side. So when Jesus Christ was crucified, the father was by the side, right? And he was looking, but you know, he was, Jesus Christ was carrying out curse. So he separated from the father. So can you imagine you guys separated from your father forever and given up? That's, that's very hard. And she, so chi chi is, is father and chi to namida chi means blood okay and how you guys write this is how uh, you can write this like this so one here one here one one done 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 okay i want everyone to try this in the notebook now write again The first one is this, take like a little curve and then down and then straight and down like seven almost. And then two bars at the bottom, okay? It's like, it's like almost, it's like a prison, you know, and with a little antenna on the top that's crooked and the floor is flat, okay? So that's blood. In Chinese and Japanese, chi 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 to to means and okay. So you, I hope you guys are learning a lot. As a review, we're learning kara is from. Okay, chi to namida, namida. How do you spell namida? Na. Me, Amida. Okay. This is that we put two. Okay. She thought Namida. Namida is, everyone say Namida. Namida is tears. Namida. Chi, chi to Namida. Chi to Namida. Blood and tear. Nagashi Nagara. Nagashi means flowing. Okay, this is how you write Namida. Okay, and I'll check next week how you guys are doing. Um, because here I gotta do some discipleship here, but we got to meet uh, um, Ella here. Ella was here too, so Ella Don. Don't know if you remember her, but um. Here's here, here's this, and uh, namida, na, mida, tears. Jesus took on the curse of us, and it's not easy to carry the burden. Our lying, our dishonor to parents, our blasphemies, our, all our, for our whole life, if we confess Jesus as Lord, he sacrificed for us. Okay, so I hope you guys got this kara. And uh, she, she means father. And um, tomoni, together by the side. Motoni, motoni, sorry, motoni. And here's how you write father. One, two, three, four. Isn't that easy? That's father. I want everyone to write that father. And uh, motoni. Okay, and I'll teach you guys the extra one. Tomoni, <laughs> moto, and tomo, it can mean different. So tomoni means together, and motoni means by the side or, or two words, two words. Motoni is, moto means um, the source, okay, the source. Motoni means the source. And you guys can write the source. Moto. If you say moto, right? Moto and do is different, right? And uh, moto 
もっと means more. もっとお願いします。Right? If you want to add more rice. もっとお願い。Okay? もっとお願い。Remember how do I all? Right here. おねが、はい、two thoughts。もっとお願い。Okay? もっとお願い。more please。ご飯もっとお願い。飯もっとお願い。ご飯 is rice, right? If we say rice, ご飯。ご飯もっとお願い。Okay? Everyone say ご飯もっとのお願い。And, uh, もっとに means to where he is, to where he or she is. Okay, it might be a little confusing. To where that thing is, going back to. Okay, and tomoni means, I, I made a mistake. Tomoni is by the side or together. Okay, tomoni is together. Okay, and then, and then we learn she is blood, and you write it like this. Namida, you write it like here, and it means tears. Okay. Tears. Okay, because Christ will carry that burden for us, and it's not easy. Kotoku ni? Uh, kotoku means lonely. Ko. I'll use Johnny's for color of this. Okay. okay, kotoku means lonely. Have you guys ever felt lonely? You cannot if you felt so. But Christ is always with you. And you guys have a lot more friends than I had <laughs> when I was a kid. Because when I was a kid in Hong Kong, it's just really bad. People don't love each other. And it's pretty sad. But you guys have Christ. You guys have him. And, you know, he is with you. So... Kodoku, kodoku. Can you guys bring up that? Kodoku. Right, we have K-O, ko. Doku. Okay, let's write it better. Tall, and it's like tall, right? Remember the tall? And then you just had two dots. Kodoku. Kodoku means lonely, okay? If you see a Japanese person and you're sharing gospel, I suggest you guys, first, you share your own, who you were before trusting in God, okay? And maybe you are selfish. Maybe you are, you are, you know, you keep on sinning. And then you tell them, second is, what's your story, right? How did God change you? And, and three, what happened before and after, right? You become more loving. You can honor your parents. You can love brothers, sisters. And lastly, you know, ask them a question, right? Would you want this? Would you not want loneliness and want this? And that's the way you share a gospel. So, kodoku ni tatakao. Takakao means fight, okay? And Johnny, if you're watching this, you know, do a fighting stance. You know? <laughs> tatakao, okay? Ta. So, it's pretty easy. It's just two ta. Tata. Kao. Okay? Ta. Tatakao. Look how, okay, last few one I could have done better. Let's write it down. Tataka. Ooh. Okay, 
戦う。means fighting. Okay. こうの、this is a means さんの姿。こう、in sun no means possibly yes sugata su want you guys to write it too su you don't have to look at a screen either you have to look at your own table and figure out sukata okay sukata sukata two dots because it's shika Sugata, TA. So form, his form or his look, okay? Form or appearance, okay? Appearance. His look. How did he look, okay? But the best is to say appearance, if you guys can say appearance. And write it A P P E A R A N C E. Sugata appearance. Okay. And the A N no inochi. A N means for eternal. A A N. Okay. A is this. And you write it like this. Okay. And N, you write it like this. It's a little hard. Choo, choo, choo. And then choo, 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 choo. A N no inochi. Okay. Inochi. Inochi means life. Okay. Inochi. Okay. Atairu tameni atae means give. And uh, if you guys have time, you know, whatever, whichever one words, words you don't get it. You just go back because I'm going a little fast so that you guys can replay and learn all. A ta atai means give. Okay, and then we will use uh, Elizabeth's favorite color. And thank you for the drawing again, Elizabeth. Mr. Ming really loves it. Mr. Ming was pretty going for tough things, but. Um, yeah, your drawing really encouraged me. Um, that guys me back to God because when we love each other, it guides us back to God. So we gotta remember to love each other, so that we love God with our heart, soul, mind, and strength, and love our neighbor as ourselves. Okay, atelu tameni to give tameni means for the reason. Okay, for the reason, for the reason to give us eternal life. So you, you have to, in Japanese, you almost have to read it backwards. Okay, eternal life, give tameni, for the reason of. Because in English, we would say for the reason of giving us eternal life. So that's backwards, right? But um, we have to notice this about Japanese. Okay, last one, last one. Doro, doro means um, mud swamp, okay? Do, Doronaka gara from right gara naka means in the middle. Okay. Naka in the middle. Naka kara means from the middle of this mud swamp. Sku, right? Remember sku? Kiristo yes, let's do your memories words here. Kiristo yes wa yono yono zumibito sku tameni kami no miko yes kiristo yono tameni jichika no une shinareta. 
let's let's revisit that verse. Suku, okay. How many again for the reason, right? Okay, so that's that's it for this week. I want you guys to dive deep on these, and um, yeah. So I'll see you guys next time, and let me pray for you guys too. Holy Father, we just thank you for each one of the kids listening. We pray that you would help us to be able to share your gospel in Japanese, strengthen them so that they might be a missionary in Japan. Um, if that's your will, help them to grow in you, grow their character. Thank you for Johnny. He's always brave. He's smart and he is not afraid. He's courageous every time saying the answer. And um, thank you for Sharon. She's She's smart and quiet and such a helper. Thank you for Elizabeth. She is a huge encouragement. She is always there for her brother and sister. She's such a model exemplary example of the sister. I appreciate all of them. I pray that you grow their character. Let them be confident in their own. Um, what you tell them the answer is, instead of following what others say, help them to do stand strong stand firm in their in their um in you and also stand firm in their opinion and trust in you and lord we ask that you help um the stoicists too for their new kids give strength to the head of family and the church of family and encourage them in your word and continue to strengthen them provide for them mightily physically and spiritually again provide for all of us to so that we can walk in our calling and think about our calling. Guide the kids, Johnny, Elizabeth, Sharon, each of them to their own calling of following you in whatever ways, maybe it's making swords in Japan, following you. Maybe it is you know being a nurse in Japan, following you. Maybe it is being a counselor in Japan, following you. Maybe it is being pastor in Japan, whatever it is, Lord, we pray that they would study the word of God because word of God is able to equip all men for all good works. I'm going to have a heavy week and we love you, Lord. In Christ's name I pray. Amen. Okay, well, study this well and uh, try to write. Oh, sorry, I didn't put, try to write this, um, you know, all these out. And Kikoi, yeah. Ki. This mean kikoya means hurt. Okay, so that's all we do. And um, I have to go, but um, let me know if you have any question, let your mommy know, and then email me back. And then um, I hope you guys printed that sheet out. And um, as you printed that sheet out, I want you guys to write each of them once and they should have the instruction on there, um, on the sheets to write it out. So I'll see you guys next time. And I love you so much. And you guys are such encouraging people.